Hello everyone, Louis Farm Guy here with the, with the new the new mod review for Friday, April the 9th. And we have a classic, our first Alice Chalmers. It's the Alice Chalmers 8550 by Julian F. Modding. 11.37 megabytes to download. Oh, excuse me. Only nine slots on console. Where will we find it? Well, over here. In large tractors, of course, because it is a large tractor. However, it is a classic old tractor. 8550, 136,100 to purchase. Uh, a 302 horsepower. That's it. That's the uh, that's the engine. It has well. It's basically a manual transmission. Uh, 631 liters of fuel, 19 miles per hour, so not too quick. 13.6 tons and uh, nine slots. Now, we do have a few options. Tire options mostly. Michelin, uh, Midas, uh, well, Michelin, Midas. So, we'll start with Michelin. Let's zoom in here because this is, this is it, folks. Uh, you get the standard. You get duals, which are kind of like narrow duals. Wides, dual wides, um, somewhat smaller ones and duals, and back to the starting ones. Now in Midas, basically you get those or duals. Right. Uh, terminal, that's uh, just a bunch of $7,500 that you're throwing to the wind. And exhaust, now we have the standard uh, factory type looking exhaust and the straight pipes, which are a very cool $200 option, which is totally worth it. <laughs> right, and that's it. That's it for options. Now we get in and look in the interior. It looks sorry, it looks very skinny, doesn't it? Not a whole lot of room in here. Um, they do have uh, the shifter, and it's kind of going and doing its stuff, and things are shaking and humming and shaking and humming, 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 humming. Uh, <laughs> uh, the uh, tachometer works on the dash. Very nice. Um, you are not getting anywhere quick with this. From a standing still, it uh, it takes a bit to get up to speed, and if you're pulling something, it's totally not going to go anywhere. Uh, lights, uh, signals are up there. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, uh, if you have, uh, well, we got two of these working in the field right now. Um, the other thing is, um, it's only a pin hitch only on these things. So, you could throw a lifter, uh, front lifter on there to do stuff if you really want to do something. But if you're just going standard, there's not a whole lot of equipment that's going to hook to that, that this thing can pull. Because most of the, uh, pin hitch type pull equipment um, is very high horsepower so just having said that we have one here which is a cultivator um, uh, which is rated at uh, 375 horsepower so it's over and it's nine miles per hour so he's actually doing right now he's doing pretty good for but um, when he turns around and, and, and gets going, he's searching pretty hard through the gears, trying to find a gear that's going to work, and it's really not working for him. It's a little bit too much for him. Uh, I do like the cool, though. Notice when the when he hits the hits the power, the, the, the smoke stacks blow black smoke, just like it would in real life. Um easy going here and it's like yeah oh, so the engine's not really working too hard and uh as soon as he puts puts it down bam bam the black smoke comes out <laughs> and he's having a little bit of, it's working just backing up now as we go forward here there he puts up he puts the hammer down and she's working hard to get up to that speed and there we go he found the right gear seven miles per hour is it now we have um we have them working on this this planter is rated at 300 horsepower 
But we finally got up to 11 miles per hour. It took them a while to get there. So don't expect a big powerhouse of a machine. This thing is uh, low powered and it's slow. Um, but it's classic and it's cool and uh, you get up close and uh, you can tell when the thing's working because it starts blowing black smoke. Pretty cool. Um, other than that, there's no problems with it. Um, they uh, they turn around. Uh, they operate the um, equipment uh, well. And um, they look good doing it. So just it's t it's going to be tough to find implements that um, that it'll be able to use uh, until some more come out. Maybe low powered. Uh, pin hitch type um, if you're just trying to use base game stuff it's going to be a little bit of a search but it's not, un, not not impossible it's just so here we go he's he's searching through these manual transmissions it takes a little while for them to figure out what gear um, they, they want to be in he's kind of stuck at seven miles per hour and at some point they figure out how to get out but by that time they're they're at the end of the they're at the end of the um, field already so anyways with all that being said that is your Alice Chalmers 8550 by Julian F modding 11.37 megabytes to download and only nine slots on console so maybe you're having a retro starting a retro farm this will fit right in there. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game. Till next time. Bye -bye.